It is spilling or sipping. One thing you can be sure of is we got tea. Welcome to the latest entertainment news analysis show on the planet. This is Tea Time on Plus TV Africa. I'm Ife Oluwa and I'm here with the smart and intelligent Ife Omai. And before we dive into the conversation for the day, you can join the conversation by sending in your messages on to 0906-0000-5719. I repeat, 0906-5719. How Hello. you doing, man? I'm having a flu, so you're just gonna have to work with me today. Don't worry, don't worry. I got you. You know, I always got your back, yeah, yeah, man. No, I always got this. your back. Oh, yeah. Yeah, to my hey. And by the way, in case you guys are wondering where Elsie is, she's somewhere in the world having fun. Don't <laughs> Living stop. her best life. You know life. what? Do not call, do not do, just leave her. She deserves the rest. She's been working all year long, yeah. all year round. And, uh, you, as you know, also very hard working, so she deserves the rest. So please Absolutely. let her enjoy this if time. If it's not that you're sending my girl money, just don't. Yes, her. the only <laughs> time you should call is send that money and put to my own interest for doing this ad. But do you want I'll to? Be, yes, now, of course. <laughs> <laughs> All right, man. You know what's up. Elsie, we love you, yeah? Yes, enjoy you. your Miss break. You. All right, so um, first in our lineup is Big Brother Ninja, which we cannot help but talk about. Of course. Just recently, we had Kid Wire and Prince in the studio, and um, the recent eviction took place last night, and it was Tricky T and Ozo who left. Yes. The I Big mean, Brother. Tricky T was a given. I mean, I feel like they didn't even bother to, you know, campaign or whatever, because the competition was just really tight. But to be very honest with you, I couldn't put my finger on it to say, ah, for sure, this person is going home yeah, with, with Tricky yeah. T. I think either person will have been a surprise. I was kind of kind of confident with Liko, not going to lie. Kind of a lot more confident. But between Dorothy, he was, of course, he's winning, right? he's winning now. It's obvious now. Okay. He's winning. But um, between Dorothy and Ozo, I feel like Ozo's game lately with Nengi is probably the reason why... Um, you know the votes came out the way they did because he's had numbers for a while but i think he started to lose followers with the way he was always I'm, I'm glad chasing and this stuff because they would say if it was a guy they would say i'm eating on the brother but thank god like yeah. the first thing that came out of his mouth when he had the conversation with him i think it was the highlight of the whole eviction if you ask me you can see he didn't come as a surprise that yeah. much but um also when he came out, the first thing he said, a lot of people think I'm a dumb dumb. So you knew you were doing the wrong yeah. thing. So why did you stick to it? So yeah. I say like Ozo was playing a game. It was a strategy. Nengi was a strategy, but obviously not a good one. You That's... think so? Yes. Because... I think my, my guy was honestly cuffed. Like, so given to this babe. I don't think it would help himself. <laughs> Find and cast. I really, I really don't think Ozo could have got... He could have done any better. Like, you know, I, have, I don't know if you've ever felt that way where you're, you're telling yourself, like, stop, what are you doing? This is embarrassing. This guy but did you notice when he got evicted and then he didn't have any other conversation with anyone else in the house? He just said, you know, I love you. Oh, uh, so well, great. before we continue this, uh, we need to go on a quick break and tea time. We'll be right back. Stay tuned. <laughs> 